Hey guys, today we're going to do an installation video on this brand new van steel shelving rack that I bought from AA Products Inc. This is model 4303 and this is going to be installed in a 2017 Nissan NV200 and I'm going to show you how I did it. In the back of the van, in the NV200 van here, we're going to place this shelving unit on the behind the driver's side. Okay, so if you're facing the back of the van, it's going to be the left side. Now, what you want to be sure of is to make sure you line this steel shelving unit up parallel here with the frame support, and you want to make sure it clears the tie down right here. So if you come in a little bit, you can see the exact position of where I placed the steel shelving. So this model 4303 was pre-assembled. So all of it is together for me and they included a hardware package. So you are going to need some basic tools, uh, an impact drill, uh, a regular drill with a half inch drill bit, and a socket set. So here's your hardware kit. You'll notice you've got an L bracket. You've got a long bar. Each have pre-drilled holes. You have a Phillips head screw with a self-locking nut. And you have a long bolt, a short bolt, and up top you'll see what looks like a anchor with a washer, and that's called a jack nut, and I'll explain how we use that. So the NV200 van has two pre-drilled holes in the roof. I'm gonna to point to where they're located, okay? One is here at the back, and the other one is here, right on about the middle of the van. So I've taken this jack nut, there are four of these that come with the kit. This is called a jack nut. A lot of people have questions about how they work, and I'm gonna show you. Jack nut, and you're gonna take a washer, because the metal, sheet metal here is kind of thick, and if you don't use the washer, it'll be loose, and it won't expand. So you put the washer on there, okay? And you're gonna position this right here, and sometimes it doesn't go in clean, so you have to use a soft mallet, and just tap it in, okay? All right, once that's in there like that, and it's passed through, you're gonna use this special tool to hold the jack nut in place, like this, and you're gonna take the longer screw, and you're going to drive that in there and expand the jack nut behind the sheet metal. Once you've expanded it behind the sheet metal, you take this out, and the jack nut will be firmly in place in the roof. And you will use the smaller screw that it comes with. Okay. okay, once the second jack nut is in place and the first jack nut is secured, you can push the shelf back and begin to do the floor mounting bolts and we'll demonstrate that. Okay, I've made my mark right here on the floor. Now make sure when you're positioning this that you don't drill anywhere near the gas tank or any kind of electrical circuitry. You wanna make sure that you have a clear path to drill straight down. You're going to take a half inch drill bit mounted into a power drill and you're going to drill a hole here for the jack nut. Put it into position, lightly tap it down, okay, then take your nut and lock it into place. Use a spanner wrench to hold that into position and then use the long screw to expand the jack nut first. And then remember, once you extract that out, line up your shelf, you're gonna put the smaller bolt in the bottom too. Okay. We're gonna take the screw out. Nice and easy. And there it is. Now you can begin to assemble using the smaller nut. And then put your bottom bolt into the bottom jack nut. Line it up. Start it a couple of turns just to get it threaded. Okay, and then you should be able to get in there with your impact gun and just Screw it, sock it down. 
after you've secured both top and bottom jack nuts, then you can go around to the 90 degree bracket, L bracket, and the lower straight bar and tighten up the individual Phillips head nuts here and here, and the shelf will be firmly secured. So using the existing hardware that comes with the kit from AA Products Inc., I've been able to fasten this securely using the existing pre-drilled holes inside the van and the jack nuts and secured the shelving down firmly. And if you have any questions or you like this video, you can click on subscribe and you can feel free to ask questions. And all the hardware is available inside the uh, packaging that AA Products provides and it will definitely fit in the NV200 van.